guess where am I today? I'm at Costco. So this is a members only warehouse where you get everything in bulk, groceries, electronics and actually this is my first time here, I have no clue how it's going to be, what are the must buy items here, so I'm just going to figure out and obviously I'm going to take you along with me as well and this place is huge, obviously it's a warehouse and also there are a lot of cars in the parking area today, I think this is how it is every time I've passed Costco, there are so many cars. It's fair to say shopping at Costco is an experience, but to call it fun is a stretch, especially when the aisles are as clogged as the parking lot. So I did go to Costco a week before this, but it didn't really work out in my favor. It was crazy busy on the long weekend. I can move my cart. This is too overwhelming for me. Go straight. Thank you. Okay, I can't shop here today. This is too much. No. I'm going back. So yeah, I came back home but with a membership but I really hope this time it actually goes well. And the biggest catch to shopping at Costco is the membership fee. So obviously the first step is to get the Costco membership. Only members can shop at Costco. For $60, you'll be a Gold Star member which gives exclusive access to shop at any Costco worldwide and for $120, you can become an executive member and earn 2% cash back on your purchases. We're actually confused which one to get. Although it makes more sense to get the executive one if you're shopping a lot because you get reward points and everything but since this is our first time so we're just going for the normal one normal which is $60. Whoa, well, even the cart is huge. I'm so excited to fill all of this up. Wow, this is huge. So I'm at the electronic section. They have all the TV, fridge, washing machine, everything. Uh, okay, I don't need all of the electronics right now. Let's go to, I don't even know which section, we'll figure out. And there's some little discount here and there, like $10 off, $20 off and in some TVs even $100 off, which is nice. I think in totality you save a lot. You even get the MacBooks here. That's pretty cool. Although they don't have a discount. Or probably they're discounted or only. maybe they're discounted. Not sure. Oh, I found this. I designed kitchen bin set. I was looking for this one. I actually need more containers for all the storage in the fridge and the pantry. It's for $29 for a set of four. This is nice. Okay, I've got the first thing in my cart. This is actually overwhelming seeing so many things around. You just can't figure out where to start from. Sometimes you tend to buy a lot. Yeah. Here, I need to control myself. You know what I found? Starbucks pods and these are for Nespresso. I definitely need to get two packs. Two packs for, for sure. sure. How much is this one for? $44 for 60 capsules. Take one only. <laughs> no, I should take two. We're over with our Nespresso pods anyway. And also, I'm so excited because these are the new ones. I've always used the Nespresso one, so really excited. You only get to have my coffee tomorrow. And also, they have their in house brand called Kirkland. They have like all, a lot of food products and even like pans of Kirkland. The entire 10 piece set is for $200 and you get everything in this. Wow, this is like nice and heavy too. Very good quality. This is a good deal. This is a huge pack of 8 rolls and this for 15. So one actually comes out for 1.8. And we have bought this tape for like I think three or four dollars before. But then again, this is in bulk. You have to buy so many. Oh, they have a ring doorbell camera as well. Yeah. Do you want to take it? How much is it for? We, we badly need a doorbell camera. Mm -hmm. It's for two forty-five. I'm so confused what to buy and what to leave. They have marked the products which has deals. Not everything is on discount. Everything right? is in bulk, guys. Yeah. Yeah. And we're just a family of two, so we don't need a lot of things. I'm really excited to go to the food section because I need to grab a few things. I did my research before and there are a few things which are really nice of Kirkland. I'm actually here for the hot dog by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard the hot dog is amazing. Better than Ikea's? Not, I don't know. I don't know. I haven't we'll tried see. it. I really wanted to buy, I have to <laughs> clean the car right? So I have to buy these microfiber towels. But there's so many. But there's many. so many, they're like 20 of them. Oh shit. <laughs> and now I'm at the bakery section and guys you should see this bread three loaves this is not for us family of two I don't know what am I going to do with this 
Although I can freeze them if I want, but still, if I have to buy this, I won't even finish this in like three months. Okay, that's too much, but yeah, it'll all go waste for us. I like this brand. This is usually so expensive, but buying in bulk, like three loaves, it's going to cost around seven fifty, which is not bad. Just one loaf is for like four or five dollars in the grocery store. That was good. So they have their own bakery. It is all from Kirkland. Bun, bread, everything from Kirkland. But see the, see the quantity. Wow, they're really soft though. These are all fresh. Five ninety nine for this much. Wow, this is actually a good deal. Who's but who will eat this? <laughs> <laughs> That's what. Three marble cakes for eight dollars. Only one cost, I guess, four dollars at shoppers when I get it. But again, three cakes. Not for me. Oh, look at these banana chocolate muffins. They're actually bombs. Look at the size. They are huge. huge. Oh my god. This entire thing is for eight dollars. These two packs. If you have party and if you have guests over, this is a good option then. But I'm so tempted to buy this. Looking at their size, big one. imagine eating such a big muffin. Wow. They have this huge meat section. The entire stretch on the right and the entire stretch on the left. It's crazy. Again, meat in bulk. One, two, three, four, five chicken breasts for eighteen dollars, which is a very good deal. And also, this is marinated. I can always freeze them though. But okay. Take it. Take it. No. No. I'm not too sure. Maybe next time. Found this guacamole. This is a pack of like twelve mini-sized guacamole. And the best thing is the ingredients. They don't have any preservatives in this. Yeah, always make sure that you check ingredients for things because sometimes they have some weird stuff going on, which is not healthy. But this seems good. Should we take this? Yeah, yeah, please, please Guacamole. do take it. Yep. This organic as well. Nice. I saw one thing which we badly need. What? Bounty. Yes, yes. Bounty. Bounty. Yeah. This you can definitely buy in bulk, right? Yeah. It's yeah. gonna last us for a long time. Yeah. How many rolls are there? I think twelve. Wow. How much is it for? Oh, it's actually for twenty-five dollars, and they're giving a five-dollar discount. So it's basically for twenty bucks. Wow. wow. This is a good deal. This is actually a steal. Another thing that you can get in bulk: toilet paper. This is actually thirty rolls for. Nineteen dollars. Wow. We get twenty rolls or something for twenty-five dollars on Amazon. Yeah. Is it? Yep. Yeah. Yep. This is a good deal. Oh. Stock up on toilet roll. <laughs> oh. These are facial tissues. So I just met this tiny <laughs> subscriber of mine. You want to introduce yourself? Yeah. Say hi. Hi. What's your name? My name is Paridhi. Pra Paridhi. So nice to meet you, Paridhi. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> Talk about bulk produce. They have it here. Oh, bulk broccoli. Oh man. This is a lot. Five dollars. Five dollars. For this much. That's pretty good. If you have like a family of even four, you're good. But with the family of two, it's just, I think, a lot of wastage as well. But I found something for myself. I'm definitely getting this organic baby spinach because I'm going to buy this baby spinach anyways and also a small pack for $4.99. So this is good. I'm getting a bigger pack and also getting organic, which is nice. Look at your cart. <laughs> the shopping cart is filling up now. Yes. We still have so much to explore. Whoa, what Look do you think? Look at these strawberries. Oh, wow. This is for $10. But it's expensive. I think you should get coke and also water in bulk, right? Yeah, it's a must. Yeah, we'll take one. You want ginger ale? Thirty-two cans for twelve dollars. Should I take ginger ale or coke? Coke. Okay. Coke is there. Thirty-two cans. Okay. Where will you, where will, where will you keep it? We have cold storage in our house. <laughs> okay, there's no space in the cart though. I think we should, we'll have to keep it here. Yeah, you gotta squeeze it. 
are good. This is a pack of 40 juices, also organic. And look at the price. This is $14. One bottle is going to cost 17 cents. Yeah. Wow. 17 cents for a pack of juice. Tell me if you can buy it elsewhere other than Costco. For $14, you get this huge pack of frozen strawberries. If you have furry friends, there are a lot of dog treats as well. <laughs> huge pack of chips. Grant, mm. there's one thing that people are crazy about at Costco. You know what that is? No, no idea. What's that? This pasta sauce from Rao's. The marinara sauce. Seriously? Yeah. I've heard so much about this sauce, guys. I really want to try this one. Should we take it? Why not? Go for yeah. it. This gets sold out everywhere. Okay, look at the ingredients. This just has tomatoes, olive oil, onion, salt, garlic, basil, oregano. So no preservatives, nothing. And these two jars are for $13.99. I'm definitely going to take this. Let's see what the hype is about after I try them. This sauce looks tempting. Which one is Jalapeno this? Jalapeno lime aioli. It's a nice combination. But this is a two pack. It's a lot for us. Expires after one year. Yeah, we, so can, we can store it. And it's for nine dollars for two pack. And also, they have these stations everywhere at Costco where they serve you like different things that you can try and then obviously buy. Sanchi, you want to try this? Pierogies. You go for it. Okay. Hmm. 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 That's nice. very good. Yeah. Hmm. Try Let's it. try. Is it veg? Or yeah. Chicken? Just veg. Good, right? Hmm. It's yummy. Amazing. And the extra virgin olive oil is really good. We don't have chili flakes, by the way. Wow. This entire pack is for $4. Spices are usually so expensive at the grocery stores, like if you go to Longo's, Walmart, anywhere actually. But for this quantity, I should definitely get this one for sure. What do we need? Do we have the red pepper? Or is the coarse take, black pepper? Take chili flakes. Take this one. You have all the foils, the barbecue trays, the ziplocs. So now I'm at the cleaning section. We only wanted bounty, the paper towels. Rest, I think, I'm good for now. We want cleaning detergent as well. Oh, yeah. Even washing detergent to wash clothes. Yeah. This is making me remember the time when my mom used to go out to get like things in bulk for our family back home. This is actually just that. What do you call it, Hindi? Um, ration. Yeah, when you go out to take your ration for the house. This is exactly that. And now you, you're buying ration. Yeah. Wow. Now, now I'm buying ration. Fast <laughs> forward a few years, here I am at Costco in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take this body lotion from Aveeno. $18 for two pack. Okay, we gotta hurry up. It's going to close in half an hour and Saranch wants to eat a hot dog. I That's really wanna eat. eat. I forgot one thing. Grand Swiffer. We have a different one, but they don't have the Red Jet. Red Jet pad. Yeah. It's massive. You need to spend an entire day here. They have everything. I mean Yeah, the outdoors. The outdoors. Even the barbecue here. We need a barbecue. Yeah. Soon. Soon. <laughs> oh, this is for pizza. Wow. Nice. I need this in my life. Batteries are very expensive in Canada. I don't know why. Yeah. So nineteen dollars. They actually have plants too. <laughs> Beautiful. They sell some clothes as well. This is good. Let's take this. Mixed nuts. Mixed nuts. Hundred percent. We wanted these. Let's also take this one. Sweet and spicy. We'll enjoy this with the drinks. <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Huge line. Around. Damn, it's gonna <laughs> take us one hour to do checkout. <laughs> There's a huge line at the checkout now. 
because it closes at 6 p.m. and it's almost 5:50, so it's time for everyone to leave now. Oh, you want dark chocolate? This wow. dark chocolate. Yeah. Oh, this is nice. Extra, extra dark. I prefer milk. And I prefer dark. Let's please take the dark. Most of the people have bought the milk one. See, all the boxes are empty. This means this is more popular. We are returning this. And getting this. We are returning this because majority of people, whatever, myself whatever, and someone who whatever. comes to our place is gonna eat this one. Whatever. I'm just a good guy. Majority of people. Mm, whatever. Like, like, whatever. Oh man, it's a long queue. And we have been waiting for like 15 minutes. I'm just scared now to see what the damage is. To be honest, everything is so expensive here in Canada anyway. And buying in bulk, it's going to cost way too much. I don't know if it actually makes sense to do this. Let me know in the comment section below, guys. If you're a family of two, do you really go to Costco? Is this like worth it? I'm not too sure because this is my first time. Definitely for the cleaning supplies, I'm okay. Like for the bounty toilet paper, but then for the other things, I'm not too sure. Finally, you'll get your hot dog. Finally. Grant, there's a huge line. Yeah. <laughs> for the picker. Mm. I'm sure the food is good. That's why there's. Oh, yeah, everybody's waiting for their hot dogs. Ketchup, mustard as well, both. Thank you. <sighs> Time for some food. It took us like five hours yeah. to explore Costco. And I'm literally starving. <laughs> oh, this looks mm. yummy. That's a huge ass slice. Two dollars for this pizza. Not bad. And even the ice cream portion sizes are huge. So many people are having ice cream from here. Next time. We also have a hot dog. Wow, with so much precision, Saran. <laughs> it's too good. Yeah. The sausage is like super tender. And even the hot dog bun is very soft. For one dollar, this is not bad. Plus, you get free Coke too. I would definitely have the hot dog again, but the pizza, too cheesy. It's 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 very heavy, yeah. yeah. It's too good, cheesy. but it's too cheesy. And we are done. Right, the damage is done. The total bill is $362 that we spent on our first trip to Costco. And now we'll just head back home, and then I'm going to show you what I bought. Let's go. I think we're the last ones to leave. Yeah, we did the final closing. By the way, this is uh, Costco in Burlington and our way back, it's going to be a half an hour drive. All done. Let's go. So now let me give you a short Costco haul. In $360, I just feel this is not a lot, but maybe it actually is because this huge bounty, this is a pack of 12 rolls. I got a huge box of toilet paper. These are 30 rolls. Also got these 32 cans of Coca-Cola. Coke is here. And also the Kirkland Ultra Soft Facial Tissues. And this has 12 boxes. Not bad. This is actually going to last me probably a year. Right now it feels, yeah, it cost me a lot. But then if you see overall, I'm not going to go out for like tissue paper for a very long time. Okay, now onto the small stuff. I got spinach. Yeah, this is the only vegetable that I've got. Batteries. We're going to try the Kirkland batteries. We've never got this from Costco. Oops. Ever. So we're going to try that. We have two body lotions here from Aveeno and we have two pack of nuts this is the unsalted mixed nuts this is the perfect sweet and spicy mix like a kind of a trail mix that you can enjoy as a snack this is all healthy stuff and also another healthy stuff that I got is this organic Aussie bites this is actually like a bite-sized oats some snacks so this has flax seeds oats sunflower seeds honey chia seeds apricot quinoa coconut no preservatives nothing so this is actually nice. Should we taste it? I think we should. This, this smells very nice. Mmm, <sighs> so fresh. What do you recommend to everyone? 100%. This is a very healthy snack. 
Really tasty, really soft. I think you should try this. Sanj, you should try this. It's nice. Something which is not healthy. Are these chocolates? This is a huge pack. Which brand is this? I've never... It's Swizz. It's a milk chocolate. You won't like it. It's actually good. It's good. But next time I'm going to get dark chocolate for sure. This is exactly what I expected from this chocolate. Too good. <laughs> and the next is this guacamole. You've already seen it. Very convenient to have this in your fridge. Also, eggs. I think it was just one dollar cheaper than the other grocery stores. And my favorite, well, I, I should not say my favorite as of now. I have not tried it, but this is something that I'm looking forward to try tomorrow morning. I can't wait to have coffee. This is what I'm excited about as well. Yeah, the Starbucks coffee by Nespresso. I'm going to try this and let you know how it is. If you have tried it, let me know in the comment section below. And guys, if you're in US or Canada and if you go to Costco, let me know in the comment section below which is your favorite item to get from Costco because this is my first time and probably I don't know what I should be getting from Costco if there's any specific thing that you only get at Costco it's going to definitely help me and next time when I go I'll go through all of your suggestions and get the things that you recommend and this is the most popular marinara pasta sauce there's this Instagram page uh, called Costco finds and they keep sharing like a lot of popular items and this was one thing that they were putting the stories again and again for and this was getting sold out at like every other costco so yeah looking forward to that and this is jalapeno lime aioli dip and this can be used as a dressing as a dip and also i got this uh, storage containers for the kitchen this is from iDesign and this is a four piece kitchen bin set it was actually on a very good price i've been searching for these bins for very long and they're actually expensive by this company i designed i'm actually going to do a video on storing things i've ordered a couple of things from amazon so stay tuned for that but this is actually on a very good deal so i had to pick this up this is the last thing this is okay i'm not going to this is <laughs> i can't heavy. hold this yeah but this is actually a pack of 40 juice packs this has mango orange apple juice fruit punch citrus blend and mango orange is my favorite so yeah this is good so if tell guests over we have juices now that we can store in a fridge that's it from the costco haul guys was this a small haul or was it enough for a first time visit let me know but yeah i had a really good time at costco it was a very different experience because everything was in bulk it just we're a family of two it just me and saranch as you guys know it so i was a bit hesitant to pick few things although they were like really good deals but not sure for a family of two if it's actually worth it so that is my question and that's what i'm going to figure out but i think all in all whatever i've got there won't be any wastage with nuts or the sauce or the dips they all juice. Are yeah these are all essential items so i'm good there but do let me know in the comment section below your favorite things from costco and if it's actually worth it and that's it from my side today i really hope you enjoyed the vlog if you did please don't forget to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i'll see you next time bye